All right, this is going to be good fun. An instrument approach into a busy airport on a busy weekend. An approach control instructs us to fly the hold. And we're not alone. A WestJet 737 is cleared inbound 1,000 feet below us. Meanwhile, a Delta A320 enters the hold, settling in above us 1,000 feet. Making it all the more interesting, this approach controller is also a handling tower, all without radar. He must have used our position reports to slide his tickets around, much like battleships on the ocean. In part three of this series, we cross the U.S. in three days, seven lakes. In Fort Pierce, Florida, a great jumping off point, we grab a rental life raft, don our life vests, and set off across the water, with a fuel stop in the Bahamas, and then on to Turks and Caicos. Papa, fly heading 100, runway 10 zero right, clear for takeoff. Heading 100, zero zero, one, uh, one zero right, there to go for 211, Whiskey Papa, thanks. Of course, the night before, and again, the morning of departure, we check the weather forecast and get a full briefing. Winds aloft mild, only scattered precipitation at our day's destination. Cloud bases about 5,000 feet and tops about 12,000. You might say we're not in Texas anymore. One of the many advantages of departing Fort Pierce versus, say, Fort Lauderdale is that we're not hampered by a POTUS TFR. The Bahamas stretch for over 760 miles and include 700 islands, half of those in the Exumas chain at the south end. Uh, so we 
Boeing 74 departing the area to the northwest. See you. Roger, Miami Center 12722. Good day. Good day. Tower 211, Whiskey Papa reporting 10 miles to the northwest. Whiskey Papa, Roger. Here we go. Okay, glide path's active. Yep. And above us, that's all good. 120 knots is perfect. Here comes our boat. Report in sight. We have 27 knots blowing at our face. Yeah. We're gonna land like a seagull. Tower 211, Whiskey Papa, five mile final, one two. Wind check, one zero six, ten to fourteen, go single two zero. Roger, 211, Whiskey Papa. No, no clear to land. I'm assuming we're, yeah. that she doesn't give clearance. Yeah, this must not be a, a real towered airport. Basically, Unicom, it sounds like it. Uh, tower 211, Whiskey Papa, just confirming you have AV gas. Affirmative. Roger, thanks. So I'm guessing it's all on a truck. Okay. Oh good, he's gonna point us into the wind. Smart. Traffic, 11 o'clock, 2 miles. Traffic, 3 o'clock, 2 miles. You might remember from part one of this series that we prioritized tranquility. So we continue to South Caicos, 
about half hour flight to the southeast. South Caicos is a quiet island, about six miles long. The economy is mainly commercial fishing, plus a few small resorts. Population is about 1,600 voting residents, plus their gentle friends. We found a rental car quite useful and we fully enjoyed our two nights on South Caicos. Thanks for flying with us and keep an eye out for more episodes of our Caribbean adventure.